Hello and welcome. I am going to be going through the top six mind-boggling scratch games. So let's get straight into it. First, we have Greedy Scratch Survival. This game does have a Turbo Wrap link, so I will be playing on. This is because Turbo Wrap is basically scratch but quicker. So playing it on Turbo Wrap is actually better than on Scratch because Scratch is usually slower. So let's play. <laughs> So as you may have seen, I have just gotten a wooden log and you can see that this game it's actually really really clear and is well made. You can see the shadows, the textures, the writing, the way it looks as put in a lot of effort. Time to move on to the next game. You've all heard of Cut the Rope, right? Because someone actually went and made it in scratch. Let's play it. <laughs> You may see that the look of the game looks exactly the same as the actual game. Well now we'll move on to the next game, which is a cool game called Santa vs Robots. By the way, this took a long time to find. <laughs> game is really well made. It's very polished and very clean. You can see a lot of effort into the art has been put in and especially the shadows and the smoothness of the game also increases the quality. The amount of effort that has been put into this game are amazing and the amount of time and learning that has been used by these creators is just amazing and unimaginable. Let's move on to the next game called Tower of Scratch. This is a multiplayer game and I have seen it sometimes not working, but that's just multiplayer games. They sometimes just don't work, but they are usually good. So as you may see, there is a single player mode and there is also a multiplayer mode button, which is amazing that you can switch between the two. second last game this is called flip 3d and what i really like about this is that it is mobile friendly and all these games that we're playing i expect to be mobile friendly <laughs> game we have upside down a platformer if you have stayed with my channel for a long time you know i like platformers and upside down a special platformer is so well designed as you may see i will show you the controls if you press the left arrow key like i am right now you move right but if you press the right arrow key you move left the down arrow key to move up and the off arrow key, well, does nothing. And the thing is that it is inverted. It is so cool. Because playing a platformer with inverted controls is actually really difficult. I'll show you. Yeah. 
YouTube thinks that you might like this video, see if they're right, and watch it. Bye!